Okay, we will uh, start this tutorial uh, to create um, spaceships. This tutorial we will create um, X-wing chip. Okay, cover the detail that we create everything here. Okay, we will start with a uh, new document. And then we will creating a box. This is front and I want to adjust the box a little bit. Okay, our box will be look like this and we will convert to poly and then I will select this line and select command ring to select all the line in the ring area and then I will connect every line I got lead line like this and then I want to scale this line a little bit to make the area that wing will extrude okay I will turn off grid and then I change to polygon mode select polygon full polygon and then inset by polygon to separate the polygon adjust the amount value then click OK after that I select bevel and then just high and outline amount okay finish I want to adjust a little bit in inset again now I group click OK and then extrude extrude actually extrude is not good for for me I think it will use bevel okay I think this is enough for wing a little bit zoom in here and then change amount okay and then click OK now before we continue more coming back uh, we come into the top view press T on the top or click on this shortcut and then adjust position I select vertex mode and then move and adjust the wing I want to adjust full wing come in the front uh -huh. and then coming back to perspective mode adjust a little bit okay and then get back to perspective mode now we got shape like this okay I will select this area to make a head we'll come in here adjust a little bit and then click OK and be roll again and I'll line them out I think this should be a little bit long oh sorry I click OK and then I have to turn on wireframe by click I press F4 and key keyboard and scale and then um, we will adjust a little bit for for cockpit area I will click here adjust the line a little bit here and this line scale I think this line too scale a little bit okay look I think it's look better scale a little bit uh -oh. I can't okay I have to select all this to adjust 
site. Okay, a little bit better. Um, click on this and then make a front address variable again. You will see that most of the tool we use is a Babel, extrude, and inset. That's all. And adjust vertex mode and edge mode. Adjust the position to make these models coming side view. Adjust the position of the vertex just a little bit in the front. Make it a little bit longer. So it's good, good looking. Be careful when you selection the, the vertex mode. You have to uh, be sure that uh, you didn't select extra the vertex that you don't want to. I think it's something wrong here. See, something wrong. I select this area, but this area is not affected. So I will get back to fix this problem. Okay. Um, because I didn't select all the vertex, okay, check everything is good. Let's move it back again and then move in front and then just a little bit. Okay, good. Everything good. Adjust scale a little bit. Okay, nice. Okay, then coming back here. Actually, in a in a original X wing, this is smooth area. So I will create connect more to make it smooth, smoother. Okay, and then adjust a little bit scale here and chamfer a little bit here to make more segment amount okay okay nice okay good then coming back here we'll make some tail part make a bevel click OK and then make a bevel by your hand uh, bevel again its side okay I think it's too much let bring it back a little bit okay good to go um, now you make a cockpit I hope I can finish this one okay click connect this the line and then I click two of these X a bevel just a little bit click OK now adjust the line click the line click the line and scale and then scale this one scale this line okay this line and move it down a little bit grab all the line here and select this line and move it down everything look good actually it's not perfect but um, quite right as I want okay I need something here because this line is not so perfect I want to cut the line here uh -uh. have to connect uh, connect the line here. Connect. Okay, got it. And then cut the line to this area to divide the cockpit area. Be careful in the cut command. When you select the cut, when you move, cursor will change if you find a cross area. So click to select this point okay and I cancel the command by light click and then select the line scale again ok 
okay better okay good and now I just a little bit here okay everything looked nice I will select on every glass area and then inset by polygon to separate to create a window frame for the glass okay and then we will adjust the high value to minus adjust the outline amount and then you have to turn around to check what's wrong in the in every part is it okay I have a little bit to fix is okay and then and then we will continue in next tutorial